Good morning, everybody. My name is Darlene, and I have Parkinson's. Today's Try It Thursday, and for today's Try It Thursday, we're going to go to Costco for shopping, and uh, believe it or not, I am going to try to drive one of their motorized buggies. I used to drive a car years ago, haven't driven in quite a while. Uh, I think there's probably a reason why I was told I shouldn't drive anymore, but let's see how it goes with an electric cart in the store. Hope it's good. We are at Costco. She's got to pull it back. I made her a little sign. Steer clear for safety. Oh, you're doing so good. You really are doing good. I don't want to be like my ailing can go too fast. See how fast she goes. She's doing great. Do I have to do anything special with her? No, just aim it. Oh, now we're coming into people. We're coming into some people. There'll be, there'll be chaos on the floor. <laughs> Maybe I should have made a sign for the back, too. <laughs> So it's a little jiggly, I'm trying to walk. I'm following her to the drug department. Intersection. Intersection? You're gonna go straight through? Okay. Yep. Take the one to the right. Can I get by that post piece? Uh, yeah, maybe. Go to the left of it. Oh my God, Toby. You did it. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're going straight through. We're going straight through over here. Keep going. Okay. Here we are in our favorite department in Costco. Well, we're uh, filling up our buggy. I don't in, remember where else we have to go. In so. Canada, this drug place is uh, where the money is spent. I'll tell you that. Oh, did you want these cups, Mandarin? Yes, I do want Mandarin cups. Is it or Mandarin? Mandarin. Oh, there we go. Yeah, I'll get the Mandarin cups. Oh, they're on, they're on sale. Ten dollars. Yeah. Go, the spices are somewhere up in this All right. area, too. You're doing really good. I hope. <laughs> yeah, go around. Costco has the nicest flowers here. They really do. And this is genius for Mum. She'll be using this in every store we go to now, I guarantee it. How fast can you go, Mum? What? How fast can you go? Too fast. A store employee just stopped us and asked if we put that sign on our cart ourselves. <laughs> the say, stay clear, new driver. <laughs> I said, we did. Uh, one more. <laughs> She's shopping and driving and concentrating and doing great. Oh, brown sugar. Brown sugar. Um, I, I don't want it to get hard though. I shouldn't buy a big bag like that because it'll go hard, right? 
Yeah, that's a big bag. Yeah, I better wait and just get a little bag of that because I want to start having the porridge. Yep. <laughs> Actually, this is Darlene McFate, My Life with Parkinson's on YouTube. Oh, nice. Yep. <laughs> this is terrifying. Is this peanut butter that you're Yeah, I'll grab the peanut butter here. Terrifying. Look at that. Oh, Two yeah, kilograms. Eight dollars. I said, that's why we're doing this long before Christmas. Oh, yeah. <laughs> All right. Yeah, we'll want to wait here for a second. All right. Here we go. And we're shopping. I like to get some one of these big snackers. Boom chicka pop. Yeah, but I don't want any popcorn makers, so yeah. I don't want to do that. What about this uh, Chicago mixed popcorn? That's pretty good. You can't make that with your maker. Cheese and caramel popcorn. Cheese and caramel? Is that a good thing? You've never had Chicago mixed popcorn? No. <laughs> that sounds weird. Cheese and caramel. It is weird until you try it. And then it's good. Yeah. You think Doug would like that then? I think he would like it. Okay. Yeah. I'm going to get that. All right. Oh, there's pork rinds right here. No, I don't want to do the pork rinds. <laughs> <laughs> That's too much. Oh, yeah. <sighs> My mom used to make homemade pork rinds. Like off of the real, like, pigskin. Homemade pork rinds? Like off the real pigskin? She yeah. They're called crackling? Oh, yeah. Look at this with Christmas stuff up in here already. Look at the fruit on the way by. Okay. I'll pretend I'm healthy. I'll, I'll you know, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think I'll buy food, but I'll look at it. Yeah, look at the real food. Look at her newfound independence, driving herself. Yep. Oh my god. That's good, but I don't want to send that. She's on the move. There's no stopping her now. Pretty before you know it, she'll be like, drop me off at Costco. <laughs> oh, they have the best mushrooms here. Those are brown. Here. Some of your Asian salads you like. like to add these rum balls. Sure look like Timbits, not for children. Out of control in a grocery store, not the heavy wheels. <laughs> yeah. What's gonna happen? One of these days I'll see you. Honey, can you just drop me over at Costco and I'll just That's I'll just run around. Funny. I just said that. Before well, you know it, Mum will be saying, just drop me off at Costco. Yep, that'll be the next thing I'll just Oh, I'm just gonna go up to Costco for about you know, give me an hour. Yeah, give me an hour. Yeah. Alright. <laughs> So how'd you enjoy that Costco trip? I loved it. I had some independence because I wasn't relying on somebody else to push the wheelchair. I was able to take my time and look at what I wanted to on the shelves. I was able to pick up the stuff I wanted. Now I just need to, of course, win the lottery so that I can afford to shop at Costco. But I loved it. And now that I know I can do it, I'm thinking that maybe I would try driving one at Walmart or something. You never know, I'm getting a little bit of independence, even though I'm so dependent on everybody for most things. But I'll take what I can get, and I really enjoyed my day out. Okay, have a good day, everybody.